I think in the interest of getting seeds onto the socks, we're going to walk through some of this woodland, and if you can pick something that you would like to draw, don't pick any of the little trees, because the little trees, obviously we want them to survive, and the woodland will look really natural in the end. It'll be, it'll look like an ancient woodland. Now this experiment all started with somebody called Charles Darwin, and one of the things that he did was when he was collecting animals from all over the world, he collected all the mud from their feet, and he put it in, in a little tray, and he let those seeds germinate to see what he actually found. But lots of seeds, aren't they? Look at that. What happens when a bird eats a seed? Should we seed talk about goes that? Inside the, bird. the seed goes inside the bird. Then what happens? It grows. No, <laughs> well, it doesn't. It goes off. The Go on. It poops it out. It does. It does so shall I pretend I'm a bird? Oh. Okay. Oh, no. Are you watching? So I'm going to go eat the seed, and I'm going to fly away like this, and then get to a new place. I'm going to go do a quick poo, <laughs> and what's more. The little seed's got its own fertilizer then. So what we started with the bird, to the worm, to the soil. What does worm. the soil do? Um, um, does it keep the nutrients inside to um, make sure all the plants stay good? Exactly, so the soil supports the plants. Who's going to eat the plants? Oh, oh, oh. Yes. The slugs might eat the plants. And um, who's going to eat the slugs? Birds. Birds? Where did we start? Birds. Birds! So we've come all the way round in a full circle, haven't we? Because everything supports everything else, doesn't it? And that's really what we call a food web. Darwin was absolutely fantastic for doing pencil drawings. That was how drawings happened in those days. So you keep the shoes on, but we're just going to put the socks into the little bags. You know that you're allowed to come and visit this wood whenever you like. You don't have to pay to come in, you can bring your families. So I hope everybody might be able to bring their families and have a walk around the wood at the weekends or something like that. 